Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and here we are playing your opener of Salus 4 with Japan. Take a look at the tech map mode here. You can see we are green. Not the brightest green, but we're pretty good. The reason we're not the bright green is because our admin tech is low, but that's fine. It's because we constantly have to deal with comets and other stability problems. You know, your king has died thanks to some stupid event. Uh, but yeah, let's go through some of the map modes. Why not? Religious map mode, you can see we've converted a whole lot of places to Shinto. We've done a very good job of that. It's going to be, you know, we're never going to get everything because we only have one stupid missionary. Uh, Empire is pretty broken. Trade map mode is whatever. Uh, diplomatic map mode is our current allies and vassals and stuff. Uh, region culture map mode. This is our culture group, all this green stuff, and then everything down here that we just took over in Vietnam is not in our culture group, so the culture is red. So we don't get much uh, tax income there or whatever, but that's fine, no big deal. The current sphere of influence is that. Our vault risk is pretty non-existent. Everyone's happy with us, colonial range, no one cares, economics, whatever, manpower, whatever, tech, you already saw that, trade value, obviously there's a good trade value in China. And that's about it. Accepted cultures, Green is our accepted culture, blue is our culture group, and red is our non-accepted culture group. And that's it. The nice thing about this, now that we've actually hit the button with Shun, we have hit the button. The nice thing about that is we can go declare any war we want now. So we can go to war with Korea, go to war with Russia, go to war with uh, Brunei. Oh, we need to start that war with Pegu, huh? Yeah. Let's bring your ass down here. Let's go to war with Pegu. Because, um, they're at war with Brunei. What is that war for? Reconquest of Ayur right, right, that province. But we do have a claim on Mulmain. We should go act on that. So why don't you get your ass down there? And we're probably going to go to the War of Brunei at the same time, because why not? Uh, they're allied with Korean Gotch. Okay. We have claims on you, right? Yeah, we do. Not a problem. Problem? Alright, we're also bringing our troops home from the... Um, South America continent. That's going to take some time, but it's all good. Now look at that long trip they're going to take. <laughs> what a long ass trip. Oh well, it's fine. I'm just so glad we actually got to be able to hit the button. You know? It actually took us an extra 50 years to get relations high enough because we kept going to war, and every time we went to war, it caused us aggressive expansion penalties, and that just makes it take forever. But it's all done now. Everything is kosher. Montenegro's independent because the Ottomans suck balls at putting down rebels. Ottomans, you're an idiot, and you're going to piece them out, right? Yeah, you pieced them out, rather than... Why does the AI piece out rebels like that? Just go reconquer them. Reconquer them, you stupid AI. Alright, we've made it. Attack. Call allies. They don't wanna. It's fine. Invade. Yep, Pegu's got an army there. That's fine. We'll drop a siege and go. Drop a siege and go. Not even funding our troops, are we? Not really. We don't really need to, though. We'll fund them a little bit. But the tech difference is amazing, right? What's their tech? 23 and their Chinese group? Yeah, Chinese tech group. That's a big difference. So what kind of shit can we expect in the peace deal? Are they small enough to vassalize? No, they are too big to vassalize. But we can force religion and we can take Mulmain. Then we'll see what we can do after that. And besides, um, if Brunei takes a little more of them, maybe they will be small enough to vassalize. We'll see. But yeah, can we declare war on Brunei? Yes, we can. Let's go for Tongu, I guess. Sure. Alright, war with Brunei. Nice. They're no longer allied with France or Russia, so that's good. And they're not in the coalition against us, so that's good. Is Korea going to join this war? Korea, Koch dishonored, and Korea honored. Alright, so we're at war with Korea again. Uh, let's fund the navy a little bit, because I'm sure we're going to have to fight Korea's navies. And when, we're, when our troops come back from the New World, we can go invade Korea. Or we could split up our armies down here and do that too. Either way.
Okay. Let's see you go. Siege and go. Sounds like there's construction going on in the apartment above me. I hear a drill or a screw or something. Uh, oh, he's got 30,000 troops there. Look at that. Let's go kill that army. That sounds like fun. Oh, he's going to Chiang Mai. Really? You're going to invade me? Okay. Fair enough. Killing Korea's little armies. That's cool. I'm going this way. Okay. I really want to kill your army, dude. Oh, now he's going to stand still. Can we catch him? Let's put on forced march and catch this little cunt. No, we didn't catch him. Uh, but he is continuing to run. He's going to Mool Main. Let's see if we can't catch him there. Yeah, we got him. Alright, kick his ass. So easy. Look at that. We've lost like nothing. Killed all of his soldiers. Okay, we don't need Force March anymore. There we go. Uh, just drop a siege and go. We'll make him spit out some countries, because he's got a lot of countries inside of him. He's, got, he's full of countries. <laughs> it's going to be like... Uh, Breaking open, uh, what are those things called? Pinata. Yeah, we couldn't do any of this while we had Shun to worry about, but now we've started the integration, we can do whatever we want. It doesn't matter if we piss him off anymore. Killed some rebels that spawned. It's fine. Split and go. Split and go. Oh, they pieced out. White piece? I think they just white pieced out. Yeah. Fine by me. Drop and go. Where's our boats? I'm sure they're still coming along. I mean, it's going to be a long time to get those boats home. Yeah, where are you at? Oh, they're almost home. Look at that. All right, let's go drop on their fucking face. Drop on their face. Blamo. Hello, Korea. I hear you still have shitty tech. Yeah, you do. We're not even funding our troops. We're going to stomp all over your face. Cool. Drop a siege and go. Where's my other navy? Um, is that them? No. They are still on the way. Oh, yeah. These guys got home quickly because they had an admiral. That explains that. Regulation of medical profession. Goods produced or tech? We'll take the tech. I like tech. Oh. Spawn enemies on our face. Doesn't matter, they're dead. Nice. More regulation, we'll take more tech. Sounds good to me. And drop and go. Rachaburi, alright, let's move on. Kill some peasant rebels. Pegu, alright, move on. We will siege all the things. Gain inflation or lose stability? We'll lose the stability. I hate to do it, but it's better than more inflation. We already have tons of inflation. Okay, drop and go. Wow, we have all these tiny little stacks. They're all so busy. Busy, busy stacks. Someone declared war on Brunei? Who's that? France declared war on Brunei. Of course they did. France just saw us kicking ass, and they're like, yay, we want to kick ass too. Okay, cool. Let's move on to... Come down here. Ligor. Wow, that fell quickly. 
probably because it was rebel controlled earlier and never really got many troops back into the fort. Drop and go. And we destroyed his only army. Good. Nope. He built another 1k stack. Alright. Fair enough, you can have your 1k stack, Korea. It's all you, baby. Mumain has fallen. So has a rock. Alright. Good. Is this Brunei? Yeah, that's Brunei up there as well. We can get there, but... Hopefully our vassal's gonna go there. Nope, our vassal's just ignoring it. Right, never mind. Stupid vassal, so dumb. Although we do have the Oirat Horde down here. Go Oirat Horde. Uh, I think our navy's pretty set right now. Do they, they still do have a navy. Is that their only ships? No, they have more. Where's their ships? Fuck if I know. I don't see Brunei's ships anywhere. Uh, let's take our main navy down to... Actually, go help with this siege. That's taken a while. Negative 77. Wow. Oh. Mumain is done. Or Pegu is done. So let's talk peace. So it's too much to vassalize him. How much is Mumain worth? It's worth 15. It's not quite worth much. Uh, we will get aggressive expansion for this a little bit. I think what we'll do is we'll make him return a quarter per nine. Something cheap to get him underneath that limit. 8%. Uh, what's the cheap? Ligor. Yeah, make you give Ligor back. Okay. Great. Then next time we go to war, we can just vassalize him. That'll work. Give me some dollars. Give me your... Oh, we can do the religion. That'll work. To the religion. Don't care about trade power. Great. So that war is over. You can now go invade. Oh, we don't have access down here anymore. Shoot. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter that much, but still. Yeah, we can't get we can't get through there anymore. Uh, can you give me access, please? Police? No, they don't want access. Alright, fuck it. We already have troops down here. I'm not going to bother. Everyone just keep on sieging whatever you're sieging. And we don't want to start coring that province. Well, we can't do it because we're at war with Brunei, who also has a core there. Fine. Some coalition I don't care about. Oh, it's got to be you guys, right? Yeah, they're like, coalition against Japan. We'll just get relations up. It's all good. Oh man, they got peasant rebels everywhere. Look at this shit. And converted Champa sack. Alright, keep on converting. Don't stop on my account. Army is under attack in Vietnam. Help them out, I guess. Good. And we're actually taking some provinces now. Um, go help out over here. This one's taking too long. Now, do we have claims on Korea? We do, down here. Alright. I'll just take that one, then. Probably should go back to improving relations with the Oirat Horde, because we can start integrating them soon. Vientan is done. Group up, head on down to Sukhothai, that's fine. You guys are done over here. Why don't you go to, um, you go meet up in Yudong.
Okay, more provinces falling. Very good. Go help in the capital. Ottomans are at war. What is the war, Ottomans? Talk to me. Nobody that matters. Sure. We're already at 30% integration. Wow, it's going quick. I love it. Pyongyang has fallen. Very good. That's the one we have a claim on. Lantern. Alright. We lost a claim on Chumash. That's against Castile. And it's in California, Oregon. We don't really care. Any good missions out there? Conquer Shiamen. No. Enemy of our enemy. Who's this? Aragon? Nah. School establishment. You know, we're getting towards the end of the game. Why not? Go ahead and do school, school establishment. It's not the best decision ever, but why not? Okay, let's go to the capital. Revolt and Makassar. Yeah. Stupid Makassari nationalists. What do you know? I'll tell you what I know. I'll tell you I know 44 guys who are about to land on your fucking face. That's what I know. Sukhothai, all right. Oh, rebels are going to siege my province back. Damn it. Stupid rebels. We're just making progress on the capital. It's taking a while, but still. Making progress. Tax it. Sounds good to me. And we killed the Makassarian nationalists. Good. Back on the boat. Back to Jiangmen. Time to tech up. What tech? Admin tech. Nope. No, 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 no. Peace, that's cute. I had high. Alright, so this army's done. Man, it's got 29 cab in it. What a waste. Uh, just go sit in Thangwong. It's fine. You guys, I guess you can stay in Mulmain. That's cool. And progress up here. Good, we got the capital. So now we get to go kill their navy. Uh, go help them with Sui. So, say hello to my navy. Hello. You're dead. <laughs> so fucking quick. Lovely. We'll go dock up in their capital. No, we won't. We'll come down here. We help blockade and help some of the sieges. And we can pick up these troops when they're done. That'll work. So what's the war score to vassalize you anyway? Probably way too much. 198. Yeah... That is way too much. And uh, we can make them revoke some cores, though, so let's do that. And get you... Oh, we can convert them. We should probably convert them. Good. Oh, something happened. Rebels. Bruneian Pretender Rebels. Alright. Go Bruneian Pretender Rebels. Conquer. Very good. Uh, go help down here. There goes Wasuli. Alright. So now we should have, what, like 99%? 86. Close enough. So uh, we'll take a province. We'll make him get rid of all of his cores. And he'll convert his religion. And we'll take some dollars. Sounds good. Korea's out of the war. Nice. You guys just go meet up over here. And 
we're blockading at says capital. And we got the capital. Good. So, how much war score is that? It's only 83, but that's probably enough to get a ton of things. I want you to spit out some... I want you to give me um, these two, because we have claims on them, right? Yes, we have claims on those. So that's pretty much free, other than a little bit of aggressive expansion. I want you to spit out... Let's see, who's the most war score? Atsa. Wow, you will. Look at that. That's brilliant. Got Malaka. Sure. Actually, Malaka would get some of Atsa. Got Patani. Oh, Patani would get all of that. Look at that. Go Patani. Mm, Ayatthaya, you will. It's only two provinces, but still worth it. Khmer. Oh man, I would love to do all of these. But it's just a little too much to do all of those. Hmm. You know what? The cost might drop as we keep sieging. So we'll siege a little more. And yeah, the cost will definitely drop. I think. Definitely, I think. Right? Rebels, don't really care. Ooh, a new admiral. Nice. Put him in um, my fleet. Yeah, go dock up and give you an admiral. Because the old admiral died. I was very sad panda. Hey, economic idea. Lose inflation. Finally, we're going to get rid of some of that inflation that we have. 12 inflation. Have an admiral. There you go. Go back to the navy, please. Great. And we can tech up our military. Lovely. Oh, and our fleet. Yes. Freaking fantastic. New units. Are we going to fight anybody soon? No. So yeah, new units. What are we going to get? Napoleonic Square. Oh yeah. And Latin Lancers. Okay. And that's it. That's the top level units in the game. Brilliant. Wow. I love these Western units. They're so good compared to Eastern. Or compared to uh, Chinese units, I mean. I got that one already. 89%. Is that enough now? Yeah. Okay, so since we conquered a little bit more, that made it cheap enough to do what we want. So he's going to spit out Khmer, Ayatthaya, uh, Patani, Atse, and he's going to give me two provinces. I love it. Give me some dollars as well. I like dollars. Actually, we can re revoke some cores on... No, that's going to be too much. Give me dollars. We don't have Diplo points. How much do we need? Uh, it costs 25 Diplo power. Well, we have to wait until we have 25. <laughs> Why is it so cheap? That's weird. Okay, now we have 26. Peace time. Okay, we took two provinces up here. Core that. And here. Oh, we don't have enough points. That's fine. Uh, this one still doesn't have enough points. Okay, that's okay. Everybody get on the boat. It's going to be a great time on the boat. Party boat, right? Party boat. And everyone that we just freed, they hate our guts. They're hostile for some reason. You freed us. We hate you. <laughs> Tough shit. Coalition, whatever. It looks like the war is going pretty well. We haven't really participated, but it's fine. They love us all the same. Okay, come on up here. Group up with them. We can unfund our navy. Make some more money. Great. So, enjoy that, Brunei? Did you enjoy that war? Look at that. So many pretty colors down here in Southeast Asia. <laughs> Uh, new decisions? Not really. Nothing amazing. Ottomans, how's the relationship? It could be better. And let's see, coalition. Yeah, let's improve relations over here. Where's it? We don't have diplomats? You guys need to group the fuck up, man. Come on. There you go. There you go. That gets rid of some of this 
ugliness. You guys should be hunting rebels down there. Doop -doop. Oh, we're out of time. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this episode. I have been Shen. You have been you. Come back next time where we will probably integrate Shun. Oh, man, that's fantastic. Love you. <laughs> See you guys then.